Hey, what's up, guys? It's Bubba Miss Prime. Today, we're gonna react to My Little Pony Fitzgerald's Magic Season 8, Episode 11 Molded Down. Let's begin. Hey, Rarity. Spike. I do appreciate you showing me the way to the Phoenix Nest, Spike. Anything for you, Rarity. Besides, I've been meaning to visit Pee Wee. Pee Wee? He really was an excellent pet. Can't imagine why you set him free. Phoenixes aren't meant to be domesticated. Even in the wild, they like to keep to themselves. What's wrong with you? You got a kiss on your cheek? What's going on? What are you doing? What is that on your cheek? There's something wrong with your face. Yeah. It's a stone scale. It isn't magical or anything like the call of the dragon lord. It's just red and itchy and embarrassing. Oh, dang. Really? You could have paid Zakora a visit. She makes a cream that worked wonders. Yeah, still get the shampoo. <laughs> yeah, you know what happened to your hair. But I don't see Pee Wee. Oh, maybe he moved out. Every pony has to leave the nest at some point. There's Pee Wee. Pee Wee, look at you. You're grown so big. Ow! Yeah. Uh, I don't want any pony else to see this. Besides, I'm sure it'll clear up after a good night's sleep. Hopefully. I can't believe you're still asleep. Uh, just five more minutes. It's nearly noon and you promised to help me with my lecture for class today. Noon? Whoa. I slept like a rock. Which reminds me, all that sleep probably cleared up my stone scale. Mm. Um, what? on second thought, you can go back to sleep if you want. What do you mean? Oh my god! This, <laughs> it's like a bunch of zits. Spike, what are you doing? Hiding from my hideous face. Yeah. I'm sure it feels terrible, but it's just a breakout, not the end of the world. That's easy for you to say. Your face isn't covered in itchy red spots. Yeah, it looks like zits. Dragon ways. I zits. Terrible breakouts. Anytime I had a final exam with Celestia, who probably never had a blemish her whole life. <laughs> never had a zit. Well, I'm not in magic school. No, but these things can be stress related. And you did spend yesterday with Rarity. <laughs> what could possibly be stressful about that? Uh. You could try Zakora. She makes a cream that works wonders. I've heard. But I'm not leaving the castle until my face is back to its adorable self. Ow. Uh, fine. It's like a zit. But you're still gonna help me practice my lecture. Be careful not trying to pop him. <clears throat> Trust me. The element of generosity and its importance in relation to the other elements of harmony. <gasps> what? <gasps> my lecture. I don't know what happened. I just had a sudden case of... Indigestion. I'm so sorry. Oh, that's okay. I'm sure I can rewrite the lecture from my notes. I have a lot. I can help you with... No, 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 no. Maybe you should leave the castle after all. And go somewhere less... Flammable? Yeah. Hmm. Handsome. Oh, Spike! Uh oh, Rarity. My, what a fetching ensemble you put together. Very noir esque. <laughs> I believe Shadow Spade herself would approve. Uh, thanks. But I wonder if you wouldn't mind taking it off. What? Oh, I, uh, I. Well, I'd rather not. Sorry, you have to speak up. My ears are a little bit clogged or something. It's just Did you clean your ears? Oh. Oh 
bang. Closer to that way. Don't do that way. Twilight's office is up there. This is a fountain. Hey, could you slow down a bit? We've come a long way to see this school. I, I don't want to miss anything. Oh, um, uh, yeah. Sorry. Itchiness. Is something wrong? What? Why? No! Do all the dragons at this school suffer from scale issues? What? No! I, I'm sorry, did, did you say fireworks show? I said it! I don't know! <clears throat> Maturing. Ow. Oh, sorry. So those scales are like zits. Scales are like zits. No, so he is maturing. The last time I grew up, I turned into a giant greedy monster. Well, that was Brain different. Bigness. Yeah. That's totally different. Yeah, it's different. The molt is completely normal. Yeah. Every dragon goes through it. Pretty soon you'll leave and strike out on your own. Why would I do that? <clears throat> Have you been living with ponies your whole life? Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh. Well, in the Dragonland, a Moulter's loved ones kicks them out at the first stone scale. What? What? Well, I think it's biological. We call it the Molt Effect. The Molt Effect? I told you about the smell. Smell? Smell? Oh, oh yeah. God. I mean, I love my brother and all, but one whiff and I was all, see ya. Speaking of which, wait. See ya. Does the Molt Effect happen to ponies, too? Twilight already asked me to leave the castle today. If she kicks me out, where am I going to live? I'm too young to grow up. I'm sure you'll find a nice board of gems to guard or a village to terrorize. Oh, or a donkey to marry. Friends, I guess that's off the table. So no creature's going to want to be around me? Oh, I didn't say that. That Molt stench is a magnet for predators. Tassel worms, hydras, rocks. Mm -hmm. Dragons are scared of rocks? R-O-C-S. Rocks. Humongous birds of prey that can snack on a molten dragon like candy. Mm -hmm. So Twilight's kicking me out and the only creatures who don't find me disgusting want to eat me? Seriously, I heard none of that. Twilight's kicking me out and the only creatures who don't find me disgusting want to eat me? Congrats! <laughs> No, Pinky. It's not a free day. Also, where's that Brussels sprouts covered in cotton candy smell coming from? Because it is really interesting. Hey, Pinky. Hey, Pinky. Hey, I didn't know where else to go. I can't take the chance that Twilight will kick me out. You aren't feeling any mold effects, are you? Oh, hey, Sakura. Oh. When it comes to breakouts, I've seen all circumstances. But as for the mold smell. 
let's not take any chances. <sighs> Is there anything you can do to cure me? The ailments you have aren't something to cure. The bolts are conditions that dragons endure. But if any pony sees or smells me right now, they'll be so grossed out they'll avoid me forever. Perhaps we can lessen this strange bolt effect. The smell is the most likely cause I suspect. It's all so embarrassing. I know you are speaking, but I can't hear a thing. Are you talking about teaching asparagus to sing? Ow. If the goal is to not have your friends all depart, perhaps your volume is where we should start. Oh no. Oh. Ooh. Ah. Wait. Hello? Uh oh. Rarity. today by the scores, but it seems that I'm ready to help you with yours. Uh, I'm sorry? I can't seem to hear anything. I was hoping you could help. I have no idea what happened. One bit, I was sewing phoenix feathers onto a dress, and the next I couldn't hear my own voice. Ah, the feathers of that bird can affect Bodie's ears. It's a magic ailment I've treated for years. I only know you're talking because your mouth is going up and down. Uh oh. Oh, oh goodness. I hope that incredibly pungent odor belongs to some sort of magical curative. I hope you are not busy, but I must have my hearing back. It turns out that I talk to myself while I sew, and without that conversation, I simply can't a simple cure and the directions are clear just one or two drops in each of your ears <gasps> oh thank you you're an ear saver oh and while i am here do you have any blemish cream why is it having some scale issues you have no idea uh-oh Oh, no. The cream that you want is just over here. It's a popular potion for all creatures this year. Oh, thank you, Zakora. Go, 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 go! Ah! Your symptoms down there on the ground. It's safe to come out. There's no ponies around. I'm not hiding from ponies. I'm hiding from that. From what? Oh my god. Is that a giant eagle? Oh, uh, yeah. <coughs> Did you mention the moat smell attracts predators? Predators? Would have been quite nice to know, but it's not worth discussing right now. We should go. Uh, go away. Go away. Nice birdie. Nice birdie. Oh, nice birdie. Here, birdie, 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 birdie. Okay, maybe this wasn't a good plan. You can't hide in a tree. You have to come down. We stand a much better chance on the ground. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the? Ooh. We're itching. Oh my god. Look out. Parody. Yes, my ears are completely 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. No, 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 Uh. Well, some of, one of them is a pony, the other one is a zebra. Ah, ow, 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 my face. Nope. He's turning into stone! No! No, no! Just like in Ghostbusters with the Terra Dog! Is he dead? Please tell me Spike isn't dead. Oh, just like in Ghostbusters with the Terra Dogs. <laughs> he has wings! You just. Grew wings. Nice. So that's what happens when you mature. You also get wings. Ow! Time to fly. Oh. Still learning these wings. Ow. Later, giant I gator. To produce surprising things, but I'm glad that the last was a new pair of wings. Yes, and also I'm glad you got wings. This is amazing. I didn't know if you'd ever get wings. I'm so happy for you. Does it have something to do with this molt you were talking about? Hmm. <clears throat> it's what's been going on with me. The breakout, the fire burps. The molt is when dragons get older and start to change. I wish I could stop it, but I can't. I should go. Go? What are you talking about? In the Dragonlands, families make Moltres leave home. It's called the Molt Effect. Well, this isn't the Dragonlands, and Molt Effect or no, I don't want you going anywhere. Son. What are you growing up? What if something even worse happens? You're supposed to grow up, but you'll always be you. And whatever happens, we'll get through it together. Just like me and my family when I get older. I just yeah. be me. Let's go home. Uh, I don't need to care 
scare you anymore, do I? You have wings. They are new, and I want to do it. Yeah, give him a rest. See ya, Sakura. I can't believe you thought any of us would send you away because of some silly mulch effect. <sighs> Even if the symptoms were slightly unsettling, and let's face it, the odor wasn't pleasant. <laughs> no pony would stop caring for you just because you were getting older. Every pony goes through changes. Sometimes change can be wonderful. Like being able to model for any length of dress. <laughs> uh, a bit tired, I'm pretty. I'm glad to help, Rarity, but don't you think there's wonderful things about flying that don't involve dresses? Of course, darling. Flying will also be beneficial for you to help me with down brooks, roads, So anyways, that's my reaction on Molded Down. So remember to like, subscribe, hit the bell, and smash it. I'll see you guys next time.